stripped, bare, and bathed. No, not what you're thinking. That's the name of the new show at the Dolly Museum in St. Petersburg. Ashley Jeffrey shows you why you might want to know what's happening to Dolly's masterpieces. At first glance, it looks like an art studio. People working countless hours on a masterpiece to bring it to perfection. But it's actually Salvador Dali's collection being stripped bare and bathed. The work needs to be preserved with special care uh, because the environment degrades it. The light, the dust in the air. Dr. Hank Hine from Dali Museum says even sweat from visitors can affect a painting. And that's why they brought in Rustin Levinson art conservationist to restore four of the works. It's endlessly fascinating. I mean, you're everything, you're cleaning something off, you're seeing Dolly's original colors. It's pretty thrilling, and, and it's the kind of job where you look at your watch and you say, whoa, it's 5 o'clock. How did that happen? Museum patrons watched as conservationists restored the $100,000 project. For 10 days, they're swabbing old dirt, vacuuming dust, and removing mold from four of Dolly's prized works. You know, these are people who've spent years and years learning to take care of artwork and their special procedures, their special knowledge. It's an eye-opening experience. It's an experience that opens eyes to art and the process of keeping it beautiful. In St. Petersburg, Ashley Jeffrey, Bay News 9. Well, two of the paintings are being restored this week. The other two will begin the process next week. The Dolly is inviting you, the public, to watch the restoration process. It'll all happen during regular business hours.